are the only creatures on this planet that are completely not living by the laws of nature. Okay, so cats will eat their own babies when they get sick. Ducks will eat each other if they get bored enough. Penguins will f*** the dead bodies of other penguins. Huh? Otters also f*** dead bodies, but not of the same species. Prosthesis monkeys will wiggle their f***s at each other because they think it's funny. <laughs> A dolphin will commit literally any crime that you can think of without hesitation. Spencer Pratt, you will obviously never be as relevant as you were. How does that make you feel? Oh, yeah? You got this interview, this stupid podcast. Shit's over in here. Is he actually laughing? I have told men too many times in my life what I want to make me happy. I literally... I'm here to tell you right now. We don't care. Let me tell you. Right, let me tell you. <laughs> we don't care. Things that make guys extremely attractive. Yeah, I don't care. So we've got our support trend line down here. Got our resistance zone up here. Got the breakout and retest at this level. So we're going to set up our long position here, set the take profit and stop loss, and watch the money come in. You see, you don't need to be attractive when you make money. It's easy, guys. Come on. Let's keep it going. Keep your chin up. I wanted to ask you when you had mentioned those screaming banshees as well as these sexually confused people and they were lying and I think they knew what they were doing. Do you intend to further bot to further create the bias that reduces people's ability to collaborate with others through the use of through the, your use of collective umbrella terms like us and opposition of them? And why do you continue to promote that division? Well, I, I, because those are my pronouns, and I would ask you to affirm and respect my pronouns. <laughs> there's, there's no, I think perhaps you're just suggesting we fall silent and shut up, which is what the left has been telling us to do. It's why so many people desperately tried to shut down this speech tonight, because I think they're afraid of hearing very simple truths. I'm not going to shut up. I will not shut up. We will not shut up. They will not shut up. <laughs> And that's the way it goes. Uh, next question. <laughs> Pass that. Uh, yeah. Y'all look like twins. Uh, wait, 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 wait. He's just doing too much now. Like, like, boy. Smile real I'm quick. Like her twin. I got a gap. She don't. Yeah. It's still f***ed up. Pass, pass. Getting fat. I leave her. Immediately. Okay. Berlin passed a law to allow women to go topless in public swimming pools. And I... I'm going to Berlin. Just stay focused, you understand? Keep your mind straight on the prize. He's been in. I think they're really beautiful. And the darker they are, the more beautiful. Bill! Excuse me. Can you close that door? Your voice is very irritating. I know, I hate this scream. like Carol Burnett. Can you close that door, Bill, please? The transition was clean and you're utterly beautiful. But even with beauty like that, you don't look like those IG models that he follow. So you're gonna do all that just to get cheated on. Well done. I think I it's mean, tough to murder animals. They're kind of giving off that. No, yeah, I, I'm an alpha male because I pay people to f dairy cows and kidnap their babies from them. Yeah, facts. Do you think that's really alpha? Facts. Yeah. yeah. That's weak. What's weak? Uh, we're weak. We're food so there's we're, nothing. We're, we're bench press. There's nothing. <laughs> so if there was a puppy dog right here, or a calf, or a baby chicken, stabbing them in the throat is the manly thing to do. But that, that's the manly thing to do, to yeah, stab the, the puppy in the of throat. No, no, not something you shoot. I think you're bullshitting. I think you're absolutely, yeah, I think you're bullshitting. Oh, I'm terrified. That is a six week old baby. So like, if I do this? Yeah. You're eating a baby. A baby. Yeah. Pardon? How do you know it's a baby? Yeah, but regardless, that is someone else. Shut up, bitch! Like a lot of women, I had a bunch of relationships like this where the person seemed so unenthusiastic <laughs> um, about our relationship, especially when um, it came to photos or when other people were watching, right? Like when we were being observed as a couple, that's when the enthusiasm would drop. Bro really calls herself a feminist author. You watched a 12 second clip of us and projected all the issues you've had with your past exes on us after a nine year relationship. It's crazy. Can you smile? 
For some background, for all 718,000 people that liked the video and decided to comment, hey, our photographers were standing in the rain while we were filming the video. So I just felt bad that we paid people and they were in the rain because there was no way on the shade but the section we were to, we took. And I understand it was her one day, so I did the TikTok with her, but I just felt bad that we paid people to stand in the rain. So if it's that deep, there's your explanation. One thing a guy can do that will instantly make him like more attractive. More attractive? More attractive. Don't show interest in me. What? Don't show interest. Don't show interest. Yeah. Oh, you need a toxic guy. She said she's mad at you. Hey, you I set her up. I don't even know her. <laughs> <laughs> look at this. Look at this, right? What's good? I, I'm having more more issues with my son's mother. Put the music down. You don't got no issues with me. Yeah, you live on the radio. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Now tell him how you told my son to call me and tell me he need 50 pairs of sneakers for back to school. So he said somebody else got a whole bunch of pairs of sneakers. I said he said a boy in his class hunted on him and said he has 50 pairs of sneakers. And Marquise said, I don't need no sneakers. Yeah, then why you didn't be a responsible parent and say, look, you don't need 50 pairs of shoes. Twenty pairs of sneakers. Yeah, what's wrong with that? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, everybody just heard you. <laughs> DJ Envy, or as I like to call him, DJ Simp and his wife, the boss lady. She is the one sitting on top of the throne. She is above him. He's the one sitting down, not taking up any space, covering his body, making himself look as feminine as possible, as small as possible. And this is why you guys get cut. And she recently went on a 20-day girl's trip, and he let her go. This is the disrespect that these men get, and you guys still look up to them as if there's something great. They don't have the power in the relationship. They are sips. You saved a dollar a day for a year. Do you know how much money you'd have? Roughly $30,000. Stupid!